Well, howdy folks, welcome back to this modular synth 101 series I've been doing. And if you haven't seen the previous videos, please check those out using the link in the description. Now, if you have seen those, you know I've talked about gate and pitch signals in some of those. And today we're gonna to explore what those are. So in order to illustrate those, I'm going to use just a standard keyboard like this. Now, when I press a note inside of the circuitry, there's actually two things that are happening. The gate is telling it on and off and the pitch is telling it which key I'm pressing. So in other words, the gate is simply an on-off switch. So on, off, on, off, on, off, on, off. Very simple. The pitch signal is telling the circuitry which key. If I press here, I get a different voltage than here or here or here or here. And that's telling it which key I'm pressing so it knows which note to sound. Now that's happening inside the synthesizer whether you want it to or not. But some synthesizers like this one actually give you a gate out and a pitch out jack so you can interface with the modular or various other systems. As if you look behind, we've got a basic synth patch like we came up in the last episode. And this green cable is where our gate would go. So I'm gonna plug that into the gate out jack. And then if I touch one of these keys, we hear a note. But you notice the note isn't changing when I hit the different keys. That's because I haven't plugged in the pitch signal yet. So let's do that. We notice it seems to be playing the notes like we would expect a keyboard to play. So that is how your gate and pitch signals work to control the synthesizer. But because this is modular, we aren't locked to a keyboard. We can use several different sources. So for instance, this is a sequencer. So if I take the pitch signal here and plug it into that jack and the gate signal and plug it into this jack, we should hear a melody happening. And we can hear that LFO sort of modulating the filter slowly, but we hear that basic synth patch happening because we're feeding it a gate signal and a pitch signal. There you go. That is how gate and pitch signals work.